What is up everybody, Dan Ross Racing 35 here. As some of you may know, I enjoy messing around with my GoPro camera. Um, this video is actually being filmed on it right now. <coughs> um, probably a few weeks ago, I got this. And it is the handlebar seat post slash pole mount. Um, this is going to be like a ghetto unboxing. Uh, it's like almost midnight and I'm just looking for something to do. So, I'm going to look at what comes in this uh, and compare it to the roll bar mount, which is this guy. <clears throat> so, it's unopened. Now it's opened. We will dump the contents so you can see it better. Um, it comes with a... Oh, that's kind of odd. Um, it comes with two uh, extensions, but only one... Um, uh, I guess you could call it a nut. It's more like a wing nut. Um, so I'll have to grab another one. Good thing I have a few extra of these, so I can use all of them if I would like. Um, it comes with a few different uh, things to make this guy thinner um, for if you do not have a uh, device that, you know, like let's say you want to put it on a roll bar of a car, not a roll bar, uh, like a sway bar, any roll bar, and it's, get your mind out of the gutter. Um, but yeah, anyways, uh, jokes aside, <clears throat> let's say you want to put it on the anti-roll bar of a car, and it does not, uh, it's, it's thinner than this. Like, I know the rear sway bar for my car would not fit in this if I were to put it on and even tighten it as tight as I could, it would still flop around like that, so it comes with these guys to make it, uh, rubbery and thinner. So, my assumption is that these go in here, and would you look at that, you have yourself a nice little, uh, here we go, so you can put it like this and then tighten it, and yeah, um, it's easy to take out, and then this one would be for something larger. And we'll go like that. <clears throat> um, it comes with a long one. So, like, let's say you just want to mount um, the... Hang on a moment. <clears throat> let's say you want to mount the housing to this. You line it up. And then... You would use the bigger of the two because, let me do this actually on camera, um, because if you did it uh, with the smaller one, I am not prepared. If you did it with the smaller one, it would not be able to. Uh, the little grippy bits would actually hit on the housing, so that's cool that it comes with a longer one. I've probably lost about two of those in my endeavors, so uh, we'll get that out of the way, and we want only things that come with it, so um, it has this deal, oh that's pretty cool, um, if you'll notice, this is actually a nut, um, let me see if that's, yep it is on camera, that's actually a nut, and what you would do is you would put it through and it grips in here. Like it keys into right here. And it does on the other side also. So that you can tighten this after you put this guy on. And tighten this <coughs> down. Cross threaded. And this is going to take forever, so I will use the opposite one as a demonstration. Uh, 
All right, so this tightens in to here, like so. And then the other one, it's got an open bit, so you don't have to spend all the day doing that. Um, but it's also got a section under here where that keys into, at least I think. It just doesn't go as much. Um, so, like, I guess that could be beneficial if you have something that will not fit, then you can put it up here. Um, I don't know if that's like a manufacturing defect or anything, but it's got the, the imprint that you could do that. Um, this is similar in design to the roll bar mount. Um, this is the roll bar mount. This is the handlebar mount. The roll bar mount is for larger items. Um, you can put this on like a, the roll cage of a race car or, you know, pipe or something like that. Um, this one has, I'm going to... I'm not going to put this one back together because, as you can see, the thread is very big and it will take forever. But this has also got that cut out there. Um, it does not have the bit on the bottom where the nut keys in. If you put it in there, it's just going to spin. Um, but the roll bar mount has rubber on the inside so it doesn't... Um, It'll, it'll grip on to whatever you're, you know, putting it on. Um, so the roll bar mount is about yay big. The uh, pole, seat, strip, post, whatever you want to call it, handlebar mount is about this big. Um, like I said, this is good for, you know, automotive use, racing, stuff like that. Put it on the roll cage of a car. This one right here is good for smaller items, such as handlebars for bikes, you know, motorcycles, um, BMX bikes. Uh, I would imagine, nah, never mind. I was gonna say the trucks of a of a skateboard, but um, it's been a long time since I actually was on a skateboard. But um, I have seen them before, and uh, the trucks are fairly low to the ground, so I wouldn't do that. Um, I would just use a sticky mount for a skateboard if you're going to put it on there. I wouldn't to begin with, but uh, I'd just wear it on your helmet if you're going to do that. Um, but this can fit on, like, the seat post of a bike. Um, like it says, you know, the handlebars or a pole mount. Uh, my friend Mike puts his on a, um, a ski pole and, you know, does, like, the whole whatever. Um, you can use uh, as a... Um, uh, yeah, <laughs> a steady cam or whatever. Um, mount this if you have a homemade steady cam. I'd like to make one because a lot of my videos are very shaky. Uh, that uh, you know, freehand videos. But what I plan to use this for is uh, for under vehicle shots. I'm going to put this on the anti roll bar um, of my car using this, uh, similar to the the one uh, on my channel. Um, where uh, it's on the bottom of my friend Mike's car. We actually mounted that to the anti-roll bar of his yeah, 1988 Volvo uh, station wagon and drove around uh, like lunatics. And we used his uh, mount just like this. Um, he didn't have these with him, so we just used electrical tape and we wrapped it around the, the anti-roll bar and sandwiched it in between like that. And it worked just fine. Um, I'll put a link somewhere uh, around here. Um, but yeah, so this is uh, the... Let's get these guys out of the way. This is everything that comes with <coughs> the um, handlebar seat post mount from GoPro and hopefully that's informative uh, if you like this video please give me a thumbs up uh, 
even though that was just, you know, like that, <laughs> um, I would appreciate it. And uh, it will help me make more videos. Thank you very much for watching.